Today, I'm going to show you how you can use your smartphone, whether it be a Samsung Galaxy, HTC, or Pixel, as a webcam on your PC, so that you can use it in your Twitch streams, Skype chats, Elgato game capture clips, or YouTube videos. This will take a couple of minutes to set up and is going to save you from shelling out extra cash for a webcam if you already have a smartphone. So stay locked, crush that like button, enjoy, and I hope it helps. What is currently happening YouTube? Face Palm here, your friend in Oz and NZ, bringing you reviews, tutorials, and game clips, minus the sh you can follow me on Twitter at FacePalm with a one, not an L. As for here on YouTube, if you like what you find, then like, comment, and subscribe. Don't forget to bring your game face. Let's get it done. Before we start, I'd like to mention that on top of saving money, you'll actually find that Android devices like the Samsung Galaxies, HTCs, and Google Pixels, and so on, actually have better cameras on them than the majority of webcams out there anyway. And so, if anything, this could even be an upgrade to your current webcam. So, in order to set this up, we're going to need to install an app on our phone and some software on our PC. So, the first thing you're going to want to do is go to the Google Play Store on your phone and search for DroidCam. This is a free webcam app for Android. Though there is a paid version of the app which offers higher resolution capture up to 720p, but for streaming to Twitch, Skyping, or uploading videos to YouTube with the little webcam in the corner thingy, these won't need to be of a higher resolution than what the free app provides you anyway. So once you're ready, install the DroidCam app to your Android phone. Now head on over to your PC, Hit up Google and search for DroidCam, and the top result will be this Dev 47 Apps link. Click on that, and then click the Client Download box here at the top. And once that is downloaded, go ahead and extract it on out to your desktop. Once that is done, double-click the installer to install the required software to your PC. Once you have all that set up, connect your PC and your phone to the same Wi-Fi network at your house. Now, back on your PC, start up the DroidCam client that we installed earlier, and it will ask you for your device IP and DroidCam port. To find this information, start up the DroidCam app on your Android device, and your Wi-Fi IP, which is your device IP, and DroidCam port will be listed here. Enter that information into the DroidCam client on your PC and click Start. With that all done, just open up Skype, OBS, or the Elgato software, or whatever software you are using with this webcam setup, and in the settings where it asks you to select your webcam, choose the DroidCam option. As a side note here, the DroidCam client can also be used by plugging your Android device into your PC via a USB cable instead of over your home Wi-Fi network. But this will, of course, use up one of your USB ports. And now you'll have a high-quality webcam image sent directly from your phone to your computer. So if you like this video, then crush that like button, ask any questions in the comments section below, subscribe if you wanna, and I'll see you in the next one. Peace! Thanks for watching today's video. Just remember you can follow me on Twitter at FacePalm with a 1, not an L. As for here on YouTube, if you like what you find, then like, comment, and subscribe. But don't forget to bring your game face. FacePalm, out.